What happens when you drive over 20 tubes of toothpaste at once? How about bubbles? How about Pringles? Guys, we ran over every product you're seeing at some point in the video. And some things went terribly wrong. <laughs> Nah, but in all seriousness, this video was oddly satisfying in every way imaginable. Just, just watch the video, you'll get it. And before we get straight into the action here, basically we went to a store, bought a bunch of stuff, and then we prepared these items for their destruction. Enjoy. <sighs> Alrighty guys, Mondo Squeezers. We're gonna run these bad boys over. Some special ASMR from me to you. Oh my gosh. All over the camera? For the most part, I actually didn't give me. This has got to be one of the best $1 spent in my lifetime. Next, plastic's just light enough to explode. This should be nice. I think it's gonna be a big explosion. <laughs> Ooh, baby. Hey, do you think our tires need a good cleaning real quick? I think they do. Good thing we have some soap. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's unprecedented, to be honest. Not much of it even came out. It just spewed yeah. forth. That's crazy. Sody, have you been spending time with my car alone, bro? Uh, no. But it was love at first sight. Now we have two little chorizo sticks right here. This one, we're gonna do the first one vertically, and secondly, we're gonna do it horizontally. Three, two, one. Oh, Jesus. That's, uh, that's grody. Jesus. Look at all this chorizo on our tire here. That's kind of disgusting. Ooh. Anyways, we're gonna do this one horizontally. You missed it. And here's my second attempt. Get your angle on the tripod. Look at the <laughs> camera. Dang, that is grody. Yep, it definitely did as planned. Most important part of all this, guys, is to always clean up your mess, even if it gets a little dirty. Jesus Christ, oh that my. is disgusting. You don't have anything to wash your hands with. Oh yeah, guys, merch just dropped. Only 200 available. Cop yours now. Five of you guys will receive a special email regarding your participation in a future video of mine, competition, etc. Check it out, link in the description. Different colorways available. Next, we have some chalk. Here are some Easter eggs to commemorate the holiday. Here we go, just yeah. like that. I think we're gonna get a nice little dissolve going on here. That was kind of disappointing. Um, yeah, don't breathe this in, that's for sure. It looks kind of beautiful though. Very nice little rainbow color going on here. Hey Tyler, What's up? what do you like your tires served with? Ketchup and mustard. What do you like yours with? Mayonnaise. <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> I need to tell ASAP. It exploded. Dude, I don't even camera. Oh my gosh. That is crazy, dude. That angle looks really good. I didn't get the ketchup, though. There's the other camera. Definitely got messed up a little bit. That was slightly explosive. Round two. It went the opposite way. Yeah, it went through the back. Ugh. Wow, look at that. Holy smokes, dude. That splatter, man, is wild. Yeah. All right, these ones are like the poster boys for squishing things with your car right here. We have these three flexible rubber balls here. One of them's gonna get left behind. It just flows right over. All right, let's go for it. Nice. One down. Two survived though. Yeah, that's okay. 
It works perfectly fine. Pizza Pringles, baby. Oh. Theory here is that the tire is going to condense this thing, basically turn this into the density of a Pringle, essentially. Yeah, this will be nice. Oh, one survived. Let's see if it's eat proof. Uh huh. Yeah, how can you get it, dude? Perfect. Now we have a nice little four pack of jello here. I'm guessing it might just explode again. Snack pack. I think the soap was probably the best one thus far. Look at the distance. Just follow me real quick. It went from there all the way to here. Look, look at the direct line of fire. That's actually insane. Probably like a good 30, 40 foot. Anyways. Smells so good, dude. Ooh, Dang, that's good. Um, whole bunch of dirt on there as well. <laughs> right here, we have one of these hair conditioners. Last time, it lasered off at least 30, 40 feet. Roll the clip. Oh! As you can see, this thing has some serious potential. Probably to go 20 feet in the air if we wanted it to. Yeah. So the idea is, we have a noodle here. We're gonna attach the cap to the noodle. We're gonna place the noodle up a little bit, and we're gonna see if it can go through the noodle, and it can basically guide it like um, like a barrel of a gun, essentially. Boom, Perfect. look at that. All right, guys, this is probably our most ambitious run up right yet. It smells good. It smells really good. Nothing went in Literally there. Literally nothing. Okay, since we ran out of hair conditioner, I'm gonna shake up this 7-Up, pop this bad boy right in here, and then let the magic happen. Position the cup of noodles. All right, whenever you're ready. <laughs> oh my gosh. It just started spraying, dude. It got all over the lens, dude. All over. <laughs> that was a fail, dude. It smells like Sprite. Next up were eggs. Oh. Alright guys, now we have 20 tubes of toothpaste here. Sodi accidentally smashed one of them in my trunk. Okay. I'm gonna lay these bad boys out. We're gonna freshly prepare them for some ripe destruction. The more I think about it, dude, it's an extremely wasteful video. But at the same time, it's a very satisfying video. But before I show you what happens with the toothpaste, we need to get rid of everything else in my trunk. Now we have one of Sodi's favorite treats, $1 hot dogs. Six hot dogs for a dollar, pretty inexpensive actually. We have a full container of what, vegetable oil? We're gonna mix the two, hopefully a nice little concoction comes out of that. And honestly, I hope it splatters into the camera. Yeah, you got him. Clean up your messes, kids. Oh my, he uses his bare hand. <laughs> Next. We have a nice little three product concoction going on here. Baby powder. Yeah, it just comes straight out. Cup of noodles, and we have liquid, a nice little foamy texture, and this is gonna be the best part of it all. all over me, all over the camera. So we have some aloe vera styling gel and some mouthwash to clean these tires up. Whoa, oh, all over me, bro. That was probably the best one thus far, I think. Had so much velocity coming out of the- Yeah, like shot up in the air. Yeah, that was crazy. Nothing more in my childhood did I want to see besides Miracle Bubbles and Orchard Park original chocolate flavored syrup mixed together beneath my vehicle. What we'll a nice little oily element along with the chocolatey substance right here. Three, two, one. Oh! Oh! oh. <laughs> Oh. oh my 
my what? gosh! <laughs> Dude. That was amazing. Dude, the bubble shot out. Dude, that's insane. Look at the chocolate velocity. Here I am. That's got to be the best one thus far, in my opinion. All right, the chocolate bubble swirl is going to be difficult to pass, but we have four tangerine cups and some cottage cheese. Maybe a close second. Ready? Going for it. Oh. Ooh. Okay, this one actually exploded quite a bit. This bad boy right here went all the way right here was the radius. Cottage cheese was pretty lame, to be honest. That was a nice, pleasant little explosion, but nothing major. All right, so you had a good idea to compress the air right here and then just leave it right under. So we have a pretty compressed bag of mellows here. It might pop and give us a nice little explosion. Couple pops, but no crackle. Alrighty, folks, we're gonna have our longest drive yet. We have a six pack of donuts, a blue Play Doh, a bag of Lay's chips, a green noodle, and a red noodle. This will be the longest drive yet. I'm really curious to see what happens with the noodles. I think they just compress. Yeah, kind of lame. Still intact though, to be honest. Time for the toothpaste. Right here we have 20 Colgate toothpaste tubes. Ripe for destruction. And today, they meet their maker. Right here, we have a beastly behemoth of a wheel that is going to crush those toothpaste into oblivion. This is something I've waited my entire life to be able to do. And now, I've been gifted with the opportunity to finally do it. All right, folks, now's the moment you've all been waiting for. My bad, I actually missed the toothpaste tubes. Let me try that one more time. All right, round two. Oh! What? Look at your tire. Whoa, there's a couple that stayed on your tire. Look at that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wow. Keeping it minty fresh always. That is pretty funny though, they stayed on. Three of them did, what the heck? Wow. Look at the texture. Look yeah, at it move. That's... Dude, that texture is godly. It's so viscous, dude. I don't know how we're gonna clean this up. Oh my gosh. Ready? Use both hands. That's one heck of a mess. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Jeez. You wanna grab the bag? Oh. Can't believe people brush their teeth with this. <laughs> I'm sure. It's really satisfying to touch. Do not try this at home, folks. Do that, I just don't know how you're gonna wash your hands. Okay, folks, uh, hopefully you enjoyed that video. That was um, particularly random, oddly satisfying, strangely mesmerizing, unusually captivating, and interestingly suspenseful. And most of all, very satisfying, to be honest. Um, just even feeling this toothpaste on my hands is oddly reassuring of our planet's future for some reason. I just wanna show you guys my car before and after running over various items. We have some Play-Doh. Uh, we have basically everything we ran over somehow condensed itself into these tires. Covered in everything, really. Look at this right here. It looks like that gum wall in San Luis Obispo. Oh yeah. Pretty gruddy. However, these tires really got drenched in the toothpaste here. And then this is compared to our car before we did anything. As you can see, completely squeaky clean for the most part. No odd substance whatsoever. But that chocolate did shoot back all the way to this front tire here. Let's go see the trash pile. And right here, we just have all of our items that we bought from the dollar store we're about to throw away. This was relatively cheap compared to all the other videos we do. I think it turned out to be one of the better videos. After we throw this all away, our mess is cleaned and we're good to go. Not gonna lie, guys, this was probably the most enjoyable video I've ever made for some reason. It was just so fun to destroy things with the car, quite frankly. Had a weird ASMR vibe to it. 
But with that being said, guys, new merch just dropped, Humanity Clothing, TylerOlivera.com. Link in the description if you guys want to cop some. There are only 200 of these bad boys available in various colorways on the site. For everyone who purchases one of the 200 hoodies, five of you guys are going to receive a special email from me regarding a particular participation in a competition I have planned for the five of you guys who buy these bad boys. So you have a 1 in 40 chance of getting a special email from me regarding special participation in a competition slash video I have planned for you guys. Click the link in the description, TylerOlivera.com. Cop your humanity clothing hoodie and stay warm, stay comfortable. And don't forget to let your forefinger cannonball on that subscribe button and gently tap that like button. Yeah.